abundantly demand. Suri Devta blesses our country with abundant sunshine. On an average, we have 250 clear sunny days in India. This can be utilized for domestic or industrial energy demands. The use of solar energy in India is becoming more popular in the last few years, but still, we have to go a very long way. Nanotechnologies may help in reducing the size of solar cells and improving the efficiency. The energy demands of the remote rural areas can be met with the help of biomass energy, solar energy, wind energy, and water energy sources. An excellent alternative to a battery which can provide the energy density required by portable computing and communication devices of the future may be a fuel cell. These are electrochemical devices that use hydrogen and oxygen to generate electrical power. These cells are environmentally clean and safe. They provide instant power without the time-consuming recharge process and high energy densities compared to normal batteries. In our country, with the help of solar energy and fuel cells, the demand and supply gap of energy may be considerably reduced. We also need to improve the energy performance by improving architectural and vehicle designing and using energy efficient materials to reduce the negative environmental impacts. Transport technologies are undergoing a major overhaul. Automobile industries are opting for new technologies to preserve our work and developing next generation environmental friendly automobiles by minimizing impact on the environment throughout their life cycle from the manufacturing to the vehicles use and disposal. Fuel efficient, low emission vehicles are being designed by the manufacturers. Today, the adoption of eco technology for infrastructure and building is essential for environmental sustainability. Engineers, architects, and planners are already working hard and creating awareness for green buildings in cities with, which combine climate responsiveness, functional efficiency, and better environment. These small steps, if we take, will make a big difference. Many industries, especially electronic industry, have opted for lead free, eco friendly fabrication processes, packaging, and efficient disposal of their waste. We should go for the green buildings to prioritize environmental values in our lives and homes. In the last, I would like to say that in the recent past, information technology has taken our country to greater heights. The environmental technology <coughs> will lead us to move forward rapidly in the area of economic growth and development in future.